Hey everybody, it's Jason. It's Josh. And we're going to be doing the Ultimate Masters unboxing. Let's see what we get. So, uh, just real quick, the thing about this set, it's the, they're coming in at about $13 a pack, $14 a pack. Wow. And so let's just go ahead and get into it. So we're going to open this up. I know Josh has been waiting all day. After paying almost $300 for a box, you really want to <laughs> open your box. So, here. That's cool. Is the one thing that everybody wants is the ultimate box topper. We're going to save that towards the last. Yeah, we should definitely open that one last. So, yeah, I'm just going to freehand it. I'll just watch you. Right. Oh! I'm gonna take one of these as well. Okay. This is my favorite planeswalker. I'll open, I'll let you go. Alright, so we'll open in the first pack of Ultimate Masters. And I don't want such a cool box. I don't want TVs. <laughs> Yay! First so, pack's gonna be the most difficult pack to right? open. Right? Sorry if the cam's a little shaky. I have, um,. Parkinson's. I, have to get, I got Parkinson's. <laughs> Alright, so starting off, zombie emblem, double cleave, there we go, right off the top, Celestial Colonnade, um, dual land that can become a 4 4 white blue elemental with flying and vigilance. Enchantment aura. Now you said there's not going to be any, there's no commons in this? There's commons, <clears throat> but they're. There, you know. There's just like one. Yeah, but there's, I mean, target creature gains double strike until end of turn for two. So it's a great common. <laughs> great common. Blast Genius. Frantic Search. Fire and Ice. Really good card. Spider Umbra. Blood Floor Castle. Unholy Hunger. Shed Weakness. Ooh, Dose. Rakdos Shred Freak. It's actually a really good card. Oh, yeah. That's one Two of cost, haste. I mean, yeah, that's one of the cards I definitely recognize. <laughs> Wandering Champion, Reckless Charge, and double, another Double Cleave. Nice. So, that one, I mean, we opened up with a great dual land. Oh, yeah. See how much open that man. Look at this man. So, right off the bat, I got me a spider token. The tokens usually look better. Oh. All right. Nice. <laughs> open. All right. God, I, lo I love Eldrazi cards, so this is, a, this is nuts. It's an Eldrazi heavy set. So. Yeah. So this, can't, you, when you cast a spell, take an extra turn after this one. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. It's a 15-15. Mm -hmm. I'm going to have to try to figure out how to get that card from Josh. All right. Demonic Tutor. Appetite for Brains. Oh, that's a really good card. Angel of Despair. When Angel of Despair enters the battlefield, destroy target enchantment. That's a good card, too. Sleight of Hand. All right. A little iguana. All right. Mongrel. Defy Gravity. God's Willing. Faithless Looter. E. Draw two cards and discard two cards. Olamog's Crusher, which is another Eldrazi. Just us. God. Annihilator 2. And then a Pilgrim. Nice. This, uh, where's that big guy? I definitely want to read what he does more. <laughs> Whenever, so let's get back to what Josh is doing. Alright. Oof. So. Elemental, which is Life from the Loom. This is a really good card. Return three target land cards from your graveyard to your hand with Dredge 3. So if you draw a card, you get to send three cards to your from the top of your library into your graveyard. And if you do, you can return this card from your graveyard to your hand. So it's a really good card. Holy crap. This Squee. Let me go back to this guy really quick. You see that bottom text right there? Whenever he is put into the graveyard from anywhere, you shuffle your entire graveyard into your library. Mm hmm God! He's really good for Commander. Yeah. Um, Squee, 
Um, oh my god, yep. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may return Squee Goblin Nabob from your graveyard to your hand, which is awesome. And how many packs are in this set? 24. 24. So, this is a a really awesome card that I love. Oh, Desperate Ritual. Add uh, two to add three reds, and then you can splice it onto Arcanes. Um, as you, Arcane Spell, you can re reveal a card from your hand and pay its splice cost if you do add this card's effects to that spell. Wow. So, Golgari Thug. Devoted Druid, which is great elf card. Two cost, add one. Put a 1 1 counter on Devoted Druid, untap Devoted Druid, so you basically can kill it if you need to cycle some more mana. Um. Flight of the Fancy, which is pretty cool. Satyr Wayfinder, Crow of Dark Tidings, Miming Slime. Mm -hmm. XX Green Ooze Token, where X is the greatest power among creatures you can cr oh control. Oh my god, for three. Yeah. He's definitely going into my Dinosaur Commander deck. Yeah, that, that's all you need. So, Walker in the Grove. Cool Cottage Accomplice, Resurrection, Return Target Creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield for four cost. Basically, from oh white God. decks, you just make you play them white black, get this, and you just give them. Any target. Pull them from, yeah. yeah. Um, this one, it's, it's an alright card. They'll add one mana of any colors. Right. Awesome. Oh, yeah. So, and then. Ooh. Jason, I'm gonna let you go through this one. The Liliana. Oh, dropped you. All right, so let's see what we start off with. A zombie. Generator servant. Ooh, and tomb. Search your library for a card. Put that card in your graveyard, and then shuffle your library. <laughs> All right, oh, eventual cool. rebirth. If you return an online card from your hand this way, it deals damage. Oh, nice. And you exile it. Emancipation Angel. Or I like to call him Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> uh, Magma, which is just a terrifying creature. Like, I, I don't know how it exists or what it does, but it's disgusting looking. Alright, Fiery Temper. Another Twins of the Morrow Estate. Sanitarium Skeleton. A Verdant Adolin. Whenever you cast a multicolor spell, you may return this from your graveyard to your hand. Uh, Olivia's Dragoon. Martyr of the Sands. Another Generator Servant. Repel the Darkness. And Undying Rage. Nice. If we didn't... If we forgot to mention... The ultimate box topper coming in last. So. Yep. Is it just one card? One card. It's full art. Nice. Well, spirit token. Kanker Abomination. Oh. Oh, here we go. So this is Glenildra Archmage, Fairy Wizard. You can sacrifice it to counter target uh, counter target on creature spell and persist when this creature dies. If it had no one one counters on it, return it to the battlefield. Oh my goodness. So yeah. So Fecundity, Golgari Charm, Boneyard Worm, Aether Snipe. This goes back Marauders. Jesus, that was a lot of guys. Treasure Cruise. Groundskeeper. Awful Snout. Patchwork gnomes, these are these are pretty awesome. So you just discard a card and regenerate patchwork gnomes. Nice. Kadama's Reach. There's another Eldrazi. Ugh. Mm -hmm. That Crusher. That Annihilator too, man. Mm -hmm. Sky Spiel Cavalry. And Raid Bombardment. That's awesome. I'm going to hold the camera for a second. Let Jason do some Alrighty. openings. Do some openings. I'm with the Karn again, because Karn's my boy. So I'm going to pull one of these. Either Karn the Liberated or Liliana in this set. Alrighty. 
I get a team speed. Take three time. Take three time. The top seven cards of your library, put two of them into your hand, and the rest in the bottom of your library in any order. Slippery ball. Hex proof for mm -hmm. one. Yep, it's a one one hex proof. Rogue's Pass, this is a great card. Yeah, that's a pretty good card. That Magma again. Mm -hmm. The Skull Keeper. Cathodian. When Cathodian dies. Ooh, at three. Yeah. The Wild Mongrel. Foil. When you you may discard an island card and another card rather than pay the spell's mana cost. Counter target spell. All right, Grave Scrabbler. The Groundskeeper. Turn target basic land card from your graveyard to your hand. So when you're getting rid of that in the land, you can just bring it right back. Ooh, a mirror. Oh, yeah. The Servitors, that's one of my favorite My favorite groups is this. I love the mirror. Yep. Mirror, Servitors, a battlefield player returns all cards named, well, whatever creature. Oh, the Renewal. Got it. An Ingot Chewer. Yeah, that's a cool card. That's pretty dope. So we are only, I think, yeah, we've, five packs in. Yeah, I'll say we still got all these, yeah. all these, all these. All right, let's get one more out. So cool. I love these. I love the the uh, packs. I love the way they look. Yeah, all of them really, uh, really nice uh, foiling on the pack. Yeah, oh yeah, the blue. It and, does. It looks really and, good. But remember, everybody, these are thirteen. Fourteen dollars a piece packs. Piece, yeah. Prey upon. There you go. Fauna Shaman. Discard a creature card. Switch your library for a creature card. Reveal it and put it in your hand. Yep. Yeah. Lava Spike. That's another great card that's in the set. Three damage, one drop. Yep. Two, and you can target Planeswalkers with it. Yep. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, put a one-one elementary creature token. That's pretty good too. Uh -huh. Target sacrifices a creature and it's got a flashback of seven. Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool. Faith cool Feathers. Skywing Aven. Fiery Temper again. Walker of the Grove. It's a great card. Yeah, it is. When he leaves the battlefield. So when he leaves in any, any way, shape, or form. That is some awesome artwork, though. Which one? This one? This one. Yeah, that is nasty. I'm going to get in on that real quick. That is a cool, cool artwork there. All right. Foil. Mr. And we'll, get you again? once we go through this box, we'll pull out the um, the rares and the mythics, and we'll put them. Yeah, we'll put them, and then I will make a, um, I'll make a list at the end of the video of all the ones that we pulled too. Nice. Right, Lotus eyes. Nice. All right. So pass it back to me. All right. I'll tell you one thing about these full packs: they don't like to open. <laughs> no one saw that. No one see nothing. I didn't record it either. Spark Elemental. The Mistville Plains foil. Sweet. Full major ma full Fulminator Mage. Sacrifice Fulminator Mage. Destroy target non basic land. Nice. Just a nice little three drop. Right. Kitchen Finks. <laughs> yeah. When Kitchen Finks is the battlefield. You gain two life, persist. Just keep doing this. Yeah. Human soldier. Phalanx leader. Hero of Leona Tower. This is awesome. This is just a great card. Stitch Drake. Yep. Terramorphic Expanse. Here you go. <laughs> the most. Oh God. If you don't have a thousand of those already. But this is just. I know, I, I mean, love that you card. Need it. Yeah, I know, I love Terramorphic Expanse. It's a hell of a card. Yeah. Deranged Assistant. Oh, let me check. Look at that. That is that dude on the left. That's nasty looking. Mm -hmm. God, the art has gotten so good. If you go back and Mark look at the art from like the 90s, you're just like, who did you employ? Yeah. I mean, I can't draw, but my God. Yeah. Mark of the Vampire. This is one, this is probably, if you look really close, you can actually see the holes on his neck and you see the venom going through his neck and everything else. It's a really cool card. Yeah, that's nasty. So, Eel Umbra. Flash, enchant creature, enchant creature gets plus one, plus one, plus totem armor. Mm -hmm. Which is awesome. And they've got totem armor in green too, so 
everybody's like, oh, we're going to add totem armor in our commander decks to our big, giant, green Right. Creatures. I love totem, ar totem armor, though. The Umbra yeah. stuff and... So, back in Apparition. God's Willing. Arc and Crusade. Acro and Crusader. Heroic, whenever you cast a target, create a 1-1 one, one soldier creature token with haste. It's not bad. Yeah. Lotus Eye Mystics. So open. cool. I, I think the box is really cool, too. Oh, yeah. It's, just, it's a really sweet display box, and this whole little piece pops out. And... Alright. So, zombie. We are getting some messy here. Yeah, we are very messy. You people know how it is. And there's 24 packs, so yeah. <laughs> it's going to get a little ugly. So that's our Wayfinder. Ruined Halo, here we go. As it, as it, choose card name, you have protection from the chosen name. Oh my god. Yeah. So, uh, Songs of the Damned. For one, add a uh, swamp for each creature card in your graveyard. Wow. Yeah. So, four or five turns in, you're getting your big, big things. Right. Real quick. Oh, yeah. Um, Princess Necromancer. Wild Hunger. This is also another good one. Target creature gets 3-1 and gains trample until end of turn with a flashback. And it's obviously red flashback, so green-red. That's what I like playing. Face Fitters, Last Grafts, Death Denied, Basking Rottweiler, An Ancient Crier, Molten Birth, Racto Shrikfiend, Mammoth Umbra. Yeah, there it is. We're going to take a short little break so we can Answer this attend phone. to some stuff. All right, so we're back. And so these elemental tokens, oh, my God, they're gorgeous. Yeah, they're really cool. The Plum Veil foil. And here's another mythic. Nice. Cast the Unhallowed Intimidate. Whenever a human deals damage to you, destroy it. Other <laughs> non-human creatures God. you control get plus one, plus one, and have undying. So, awesome guard. Yep. Uh, Dreamscape Artist. I know you like playing blue, and this is one of those ones where it's going to... That's... It's going to speed up blue decks. Mm-hmm. So, for two... For three, and tap. Discard a card, sacrifice a land. Search your library for up to two basic land cards. Put them onto the battlefield, then shuffle your library. So let's just speed it up. Yeah, right. Urban Evolution. Draw three cards, and you may play an additional land this turn. It's awesome. Uh, anger. Just Anger. <laughs> Deranged Assistant. Another Terramorphic Expanse. Yep. Stitch Drake. Slum Reaper. Wickerboro Eller. Grave Scrabbler. Akron Crusader, Mother Sands, Undying Range, Ronum, Unicorn. Oh, God. I love, I love that card. <laughs> she right. loves her unicorn. So. Man, this is a good oh, All righty. Oh. <laughs> all right. So we got the spider. Ooh, Apprentice Necromancer. That is a. I love the way the foil hits that card right there. Mm -hmm. You can That's awesome. see it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> there he is again. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Now you got two of them. Now I got some trade bait for Jason. <laughs> yeah, you do, you bastard. All right. And the Fiend Hunter, which is one of the, my favorite cards that I've put in. A, um, I, I've had this in quite a few decks. Uh, it's just it's a really good card. Yeah. Um, just because I love the new artwork. And it's just a pain in the ass to do stuff. Like, I love detaining or just keeping people's stuff out of the way. Mm -hmm. Mystic Retrieval. Turn target instant or sorcery card from your graveyard to your hand. And it's got a flashback, so if you run red-blue, that's a, that's a really good card. Yeah. And red-blue is becoming pretty, uh, pretty I'm, prominent. I'm with... seeing it a lot. Um, they're, they're just making it big. Yeah, it seems like you see, uh, I see a lot of it. I remember seeing it years ago. I can't remember the character, but I remember playing the game on, like, PS3 and then one guy Now, this was one of the cards that I thought may be pretty awesome. Oh, wow. That is really good, especially if you have multiples. 
Mm -hmm. It costs two. They have to pay two for each one that you keep. So, I mean, yeah. so they pay two plus, th so they're paying four if you have another one. Yeah. But they're automatically paying two. Another Gourmet Angler, mm -hmm. one of my favorite artwork. That's really that. cool. Ooh, Umbra. Yep. Another Totem Armor. It's got Flash. Mm-hmm. Crushing Canopy. Always a good card to have. Yep. It's supposed you're green, because enchantments really bother you when you're green. Right. Alright. And the Spark Spitter, which is really cool. Yeah. And more of the same. The real X cards from your hand. Sacrifice this, and you gain three times that life. Yeah. God. That is insane. That's that's pretty awesome. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah another one of those. I know. This card's going to haunt my dreams. I just may have to give it to Jason. Oh. I'm gonna go through and see. Oh, sorry, should pay attention to you too. <laughs> Trying to go through and grab the rares while we're sitting here. So this is the token that I wanted from the entire set right here, the citizen token. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. That's a really awesome looking token. So, Vernon Edeline. So, for that right there, sacrifice. Add three mana of any color. Whatever you cast a multicolored spell, you may return from your graveyard to your hand. Jeez. So, yeah. Yep. So, so yeah. Going in my dinosaur deck, I'll just tell you that much. Um, Ray of Dawn, Dawnbringer. Uh, flying. Beginning of your upkeep, you may return your target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Jeez. It's a nine cost. So, I mean, you never... I mean... Unless you get some ramp, it's going to be kind of hard to get out. Uh, stream of Consciousness. Good card. This one's awesome. Okay, so Living Lore. As Living Lore enters the battlefield, exile an instant or sorcery card from your graveyard. Living Lore's power and toughness are equal to the exile card's converted mana cost. Whenever Living Lord deals combat damage, you may sacrifice it. If you do, you may cast the exiled card without paying its mana cost. Oh my god. So, cool little four drop for blue. Uh, Snake Umbra. This is this is the one that I was telling you about, the enchant creature. Enchanted creature gets plus one, plus one, and has whenever enemy creature whenever this creature deals damage to an opponent, you could draw a card, but giving green cards totem armor. Right. So, if you guys haven't picked up, I'm a green player. Yeah, you are. And I You're love a big green. creature bastard. Yeah. Anything to make my creatures more... Yeah, even worse than they are here. Yeah. Oh, this one's only a 10-10 with Trample. Well, now it's got Vigilance and yeah. First Strike. So, Treasure Cruise. This, this is a cool card if you have an Exile deck. You can basically cost pass, do it from one if you exile enough stuff and you get to draw three cards. So... Scuzzback Marauders. These things are cool. Sanitarium Skeleton. Crushing Canopy again. All right. Olivia's Dragoon. I know that man right there loves Jason here is a black player. So. You're black and white. Well, black and white. Well, yeah, mostly white, but I do love black cards. Yeah. Souls Farm. I like zombies. That's mostly what it is. Just damage. So... Another one that's going to be great for dinosaurs. Yeah. Double cleave. Jelly renewal. Raid bombardment. All right. So we wanted to get, we just wanted to organize a little bit. So we turned off the camera for a second, organized, and we're back. So going into our next pack. Beautiful homunculus token. Oh, yeah. Uh, Mad Prophet, this card's awesome because you get to discard a card and draw a card. And red cards, you always you always need to have cards to do. Right. Noble Hierarch, this card... I mean... <laughs> what is it? Tap to add either green, white, oh or blue. Oh my god. Blue. So, Mesfell Plains, another great card. Uh, Warleader's Helix. Uh, Warleader's Helix deals 4 damage to any target and you gain 4 life for 4 cost. Pretty awesome. Another Eldrazi. Oh, that's such a cool card. Yeah. When you cast this card, you may return a creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Yeah. Annihilator 2. Yeah. Aether Snipe. So you can just bring out another Eldrazi to that's the right. battlefield. Yep. That one Eldrazi. 
that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, asking around, uh, some good stuff. Yeah, so we'll pull the rare out of here for now. We keep the rares up on them. Mm -hmm. Huh? <laughs> Alright, try next one. Ooze. It's another great looking. Yeah, all the tokens that. from the set are awesome. They are. God's willing. Great little foil. I mean, that's beautiful. That looking. looks cool on the camera, too. Almost, and like another good. mythic. We got Venge Vine. Venge Vine. Haste. Whenever you cast a spell, if it's the second creature spell you cast this turn, you may return Venge Vine from your graveyard to the battlefield. Yeah, and it's a 4 3 for what? 4? For four, yeah. Yep, there's that damn Eldrazi again. Uh, another Eldrazi. Ghoul Steed. Yeah, I'm going to place this just All right. so I can get this. Uh, all right. One second. Okay. So the ooze, God's willing. The Artesian Kozlek, Ghoul Steed, Reviving Vapors, Whirlwind Adept, Canker Abomination, which name sounds awful, but this card's pretty awesome. You throw one one counters are on your opponent like it's nothing. Uh Rune Snag, Dark Dabbling. Hootie Mandrels, which I love this card. The Delve and Trample, you can basically get it out. For one, Commander, it's going to be pretty good, I think. Bloodflow Connoisseur, Prey Upon, this is another good card. Dragon Creature you Control, Fight, Start Creature you Don't Control for one. So Fire, Safe Old Lead, Conviction. Alright. Nice little zombie token. Hooting Mandrels, but this one's a foil. Reveal Arc. This is a pretty nice little card. Um, flying when Reveal Arc leaves the battlefield, return two target creatures with a power two or less from your graveyard to the battlefield. And you can see it has Evoke 5. Uh, 5 in white. So, it's pretty awesome. It's pretty nice. So, right, just gonna go over there. We'll take a look at those in a little bit. Dawn Charm. Spirit Cairn. Brawn. Now, this is one of the cards that I think is gonna be pretty good for green decks. Um, I'm gonna try and run it in dinosaurs and elementals. Um, as long as Brawn is in your graveyard, you control forest, which if you play dinosaurs, you're gonna have forest. Creatures you control have trample. Now, I know that's not unheard of for dinosaurs, but to give trample to smaller things just makes them even more just brutal. Faith Fitters. Skywing Avon. Fairy Temper. Slum Reaper. Hooting Mandrills. Another one. Death Denied. To an X target creature cards from your graveyard to your hand. That's a nice little card. Sanctuary Skeleton. Arena Athlete. That's another good card. God's Willing. And Soulfire. Opening another pack. Spirit. A foil warlord T-Rex. It's a nice card. Engineered explosives. Now this is cool. Sunburst. This card enters the battlefield with a charge counter for each color mana you spent to cast it. Two, sacrifice in your engine engineered explosives, destroy each non-land permanent with a converted mana cost equal to the number of charge counters on engineered explosives. Eh, you could argue that's a pretty good card. I think it's going to be awesome to get rid of some of those, you know, cheap cost planeswalkers, that sort of stuff. Shriek Ma. Become Mints. Um, 
nice little game ender card here for green decks. That little plus six, plus six that you can basically do. If if you're trying to make it your last turn, you can do the delve. And each card you exile from your graveyard of casting these spells for ones, so you could exile five cards, make it a one cost, make a six, six. Some green decks really need that extra power for their trample. Golgari Charm. Treasure Cruise. Stitch Drink. Scuzzback Marauders. Patchwork Gnomes. Kadama's Reach. Twins of the Mara State. They're pretty cool. Tethmos High Priest. Akron Crusader. Mammoth Umbra. We were talking about this earlier. We like these totem armors. The Umbras. Um, really cool. Um, little additions. Repel Darkness. Charm Pack. Worm. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Lotus Eye Mystics. Nice. Foil, I like how the foil hits that one. Spoils of the Vault. This is really nice. I like that. Heap Doll. Um, nice little one drop, and you can exile target card from a graveyard. Nice little card. Nice scarecrow card. Prismatic Lens. Here's one that some uh, um, commander decks will use. I like playing commander, obviously. Uh, add one, then one tap for add one of any color. It's nice, though. Boneyard Worm, Grange Assistant, Mad Prophet, Archimancer, Desire Gravity, Staunch Hearted Warrior, Olivia's Dragoon, Awful Snout, Raid Bombardment, Demir Guild Mage, Resurrection. Zombie card here. An anger foil. Nice. Ancient tomb. Good card. I like this card. Miraculous recovery. Buried alive. Sigil of the New Dawn. Mad Prophet. Think twice. Wing Steed Rider. Staunch Hearted Warrior. Moan of the Unhallowed. Spider Umbra. That's another one of the Umbra cards, like I talked about. It's one cost. Basically giving your enchanted creature just an armor. I, get, I know it gives it plus one, plus one reach, but just that armor, man. It makes green cards hard to destroy. Reckless Charge. Demir Guild Mage. Angelic Renewal. Thermal Alchemist. Another coin pack! Oh, homunculus. Shielding blocks. Nice. Nice foil. That's really beautiful. Thespian Stage. This is a pretty cool. Uh, I love this ability. Uh, two and tap. Thespian Stage becomes a copy of a target land, except it has this ability. So, I mean, it's a pretty cool card. Counter Squall. Forbidden Alchemy. Shiri Shizo's Caretaker. By the fancy Cathedron. I'm gonna start not showing these commons because we're getting into where we're seeing just 
a bunch of them now. So yeah. We're gonna start skipping past some of the commons. Getting closer and closer guys to that box topper. You see it right there laying in front of the Ultimate Masters box. We'll be opening that here in just a moment. Soldier. Grave Shriver. Nice little foil. Gamble. There we go. Search your library for a card. The card in your hand. Discard a card at random. Then shuffle your library. Now, I see the upside for this. Uh, especially in red. Uh, maybe mono red. Um, commander decks. Um, I'm going to try to use it. See how it, how it goes. Um, but I love this card. Uh, Eternal Witness. Garner the Blood Flame. Iridescent Drake. And to the Collins. Uh oh. Camera went off the kilter there. Alright. Whoopsies. Alright. Ooze. Just the wind. Nice. Got our Teague. Here we go. This is a this is one that a lot of people are looking for. Um non creature card with a converted mana cost of four greater can't be cast. Nine creature cards with X in their mana cost can't be cast. So, I mean, that's just huge. That shuts the game down big time. Rise of the Tides, Rolling Timber, Grave Strength, and to the Commons. Spark Elemental. Basil Saluting. Sovereigns of the Lost Allura. Here we go. Uh, it's a spirit creature exalted. Whenever creature you control attacks alone, the creature gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. Whenever creature you control attacks alone, you shoot your library for an aura card that can enchant that creature. Put it on the battlefield, attach that creature, and then shuffle your library. Really good card if you're running aura heavy. Uh, so Spire, Library, Manic, Boar Umbra. This is the one, one of the other green Umbras that was looked pretty awesome. And our Commons. Oop. Drake. Oh, here we go. Foil Ruined Halo. That's a Foil Rare Ruined Halo. Mm. All is dust. Eldrazi Tribal Sorcery. You getting anything good? Oh, yeah. Oh, all is dust? Mm -hmm. <gasps> Ancestors, Unburial Rites. Circular logic, and then we're back to the commons. I'm just kind of skipping past the commons now because we're starting to run out of battery. You start run out of battery again. Again? So, last pack, and then we're going to the box Oh topper. my god, we're at the last one already. Yep. I've missed so much. All is dust. It's such a good card. I know. Elemental. Aether Snipe. Seismic Assault. Okay, so this card, I love this card right here. This is going to be just awesome for me. Discard a land card, Seismic Assault deals 2 damage to any target. Yes, please. And here's Firewing Phoenix. Conflagrate. And Emancipation Angel. Alright, guys. Jason? Yep, here, let me hold the camera for this one. Alright. Here's the big one. Look at that pile. Just a bunch of commons and uncommons. Alright.
Oh, so. the back of the cat. Oh, here we go. One more tune of me. Your mom grows a legendary land full art. Each land is a swamp in addition to its <laughs> oh other land types. Oh my god. This is god, a, look at that card. That's amazing. Beautiful card. Alright, guys. Well, that was our thing. Um, these were the rare pulls that we got off of it. Yeah, and I will make a list um, at the end. I won't put it in the description because then there'll be kind of no point to watch the video. <laughs> but I will put a, a list of all the ones that we have here. All right, guys. Bye.